Hey guys. So, as some of you may know, I did take a little bit of time off from the gym and off from social media. I went up to the lake for four days. Not my idea. I wanted to stay home and I wanted to train. My mom really wanted to go, like the whole family to the lake, so I had many people tell me that I should really go on this vacation and just take some time off. I feel much better, honestly. Like, sometimes you just need to take time off. It's like a mental and physical reset. Now that I had that time to myself, I'm ready to just start fresh and make progress. Um, I'm currently 11 weeks out. I started at 132 pounds and I weighed myself this morning and I, I'm now 126. And thank God I get a cheat meal on my birthday. I'm so I go back to school next week, unfortunately. I had to get my school locker. And of course I had my um, gallon of water with me. And there's all these like new grade nines at the school. So I walk into school and there's a huge lineup of grade nines and they're all staring at me and my jug. This is gonna be a fun year. Last year I actually had the one of the counselors pull me out of class and ask me if I was on steroids and then continued to like question my life in bodybuilding and she was like, do your parents approve of this? And she told me that many people have complained about me at the school. It just honestly blew me away. I was like, are you serious? I just really hope that doesn't happen again this year, especially because I am bigger than I was last year and I will actually be competing this year. So I'm gonna have the, I'm gonna be hopefully shredded with the spray tan and the whole nine yards. So like, I of course don't wanna be unprofessional about it. So yeah, back to my prep. My carbs are still pretty high. Fat is still kind of up there. I think my coach is just trying to like go slow and ease me into it. I really like seeing the little small details and the little small changes and like how my body reacts to things. It's just so exciting. There's this stage between bulk and like super lean. This stage is super awkward because you will be flat, you will be depleted, and you're also not lean. So you feel like garbage. It's the transition from being fluffy to being lean. So you're not big, you're not lean, and you're just like, I look disgusting and I feel horrible. I know a lot of people who've done cuts and they get in like right in the middle of that awkward stage where you're not lean, you're not big, and you just feel disgusting and you, you know, you're not at your prime. And they just give up because they think it's not working. But once you get past that, like once you jump over it, it's amazing. <laughs> I'm still kind of fluffy, but at the same time, there's a little bit of definition. And I think I see a vein too, I'm not sure. <laughs> like the cuts are coming. From my experience, it sucks for a little while, and then it's great. Take my advice when I say this. Trust the process. It means everything. I was in that thing and I was so upset and I was I was in tears and I'm like I don't think this is working this diet and just I want I wish I was like big and swole and there's so I've had so many days where I just wanted to quit. I felt depleted and I felt flat. I have I'm lucky that I have a really strong willpower that really helps me through that awkward phase because I know that good things are gonna come at the end. I think I'm gonna do another q and I know you guys have a lot of questions about my prep and my what's going on with training and just, I don't know, me, my life, whatever. Anyways, I'm really excited to share this experience with all of you. I think it's gonna be amazing entering the bodybuilding world at such a young age and doing all these things. And Anyways, I'm very hyper right now and it's 10 p.m. and I need to go eat something because I'm gonna go to bed. Don't forget to take your vitamins. Don't forget to floss. That's the most important thing. Do not forget to floss. 11 weeks out from the Popeyes Fall Classic. And we're on our way. I'm like really sweaty. <laughs> Bye guys.